It's Friday, I need a haircut, but it's 8.45. There's one barbershop open at this time, and I have no idea how they are. So wish me luck. This is Bob Descola, this is your shop? Yeah, my family's been in this neighborhood Bob for and ben. over 76 years. Really? Yeah. And always in the same business? No, yeah, same business, but yeah. the barber shop was around the corner. And really <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, let's get started. So my barber just arrived, this is Ron. Ron, you gonna give me a good haircut? Hopefully. Okay, high five. <laughs> Ron here used to live in Sydney. When was that? Was that? 72, 73. Oh man, that's a long time ago. Thank you, sir. Down there in 1966 for little kids, and uh, and so we got a seatbelt roll bar so they don't fall off the bed, steering wheel, and gear shift. This barber pole came from the Durant Hotel in Flint, and when the Durant Hotel, uh, which was the founder of General Motors, Mr. Durant, when they closed the hotel, the barber pole went with my friend's dad, and it ended up in Ann Arbor. So before my friend died, he wanted to go back in a little barber shop. It's about 75 years 75 old. 75 years old? Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah. Thank you so much. Sometimes the most productive space to get some work done is outside of the office. So getting a coffee now, get some shit done. Done with my coffee. And look who I ran into. Remember the video about this new strategy? I have one more contestant now. Jen. Yes. What's your new strategy? So, um, I used to hit snooze for like an hour and a half. So I put together a strategy where I'll sign up for workout classes at 6.15 or 7 o'clock. And if you miss the workout class, you get charged like 30 bucks. So it makes me get out of bed. So when my alarm gets off, I make sure to get up go to my workout class so I don't have to pay them money and miss it. Nope, I've never missed. Good strategy. Focus, yep. focus, focus. Boom. No, no, camera's focusing. Oh. <laughs> my new strategy, honestly, I know who I am, so I set my alarm like two hours ahead of time. So every day that's going off at five o'clock, 5.30, 6 o'clock, 6.30, and then 7. And then I might do like a couple extra 10, 15 minutes from there, uh, making sure that I can at least get to work at 8.30. <laughs> What's your snooze strategy? Snooze strategy? Yeah. On the alarm clock? Yeah. So I always try to snooze just once. You but, try to? Yep. And I set the alarm clock across on the dresser so I have to get out of bed. My snooze strategy? Do you snooze? I don't. Everybody snoozes. Come on. I don't. Sure? Yeah, no, I force myself to wake up the first time. What time is it? Eight. Eight o'clock. <laughs> 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 All right. 